Captain's on the bridge. Mass Chief, how we looking? All squared away, sir. OOD, bring us around 270, please. I, I want to watch the sunset. In season three, we pick up the Nathan James moving across the globe, across Asia, spreading Dr. Scott's infectious cure. But of course, there's one big difference on the Nathan James, which is there's a different man sitting in the captain's chair. How's my ship? Some would say she's never been better. Finally, I get my own command. It's something that Mike Slattery, my character, has been working towards for the run of the show. And he was initially intended to be promoted as Tom Chandler moved on, basically gets kicked upstairs. The virus and the outbreak obviously thwarted that. All the other guys are having a good time, except for Slattery, who thought he was going to a flower party, and he finds himself in this sexy techno <laughs> nightclub, um, grousing that it's really time to get back to the ship. Of course, the humor of the situation is quickly cut when the nightclub is attacked. Michael Slattery, Captain of the United States Navy. I and five members of my crew are prisoners of war. Slattery and the crew are now trying to somehow wrestle the unwrestleable. They're in unknown terrain pretty much everywhere they go. They don't even know who's against them or why. What the hell are you doing to me? With the name Takahaya as his only piece of evidence, Chandler moves forward looking for a way to track down the pirates who took his crewmates. We've reached the camp perimeter. Commencing target assault. Mike! This is when Chandler and Slattery finally reunite. They haven't seen each other the entire season. They've spoken on the phone, and now Slattery looks up and sees Chandler has come all the way to find him. It's a most amazing moment, but it's also a big character moment for Slattery when he sees that Cruz has died, and he learns that several others have died in the process of bringing him and his shipmates home, and he takes full responsibility for having let his guard down in Vietnam, and he blames himself for everything that happened. It's all my fault. Never should have gone in that nightclub. And that's part of the burden of leadership. One of the things that he hasn't had to carry all this time is the loss of life really being on, on his head. That was a nice flavor change for me. I was able to uh, show my kinder, gentler side. The Last Ship, all new Sundays at 9 on TNT, and watch anytime on demand.